Hi, this is Mato. In this video, I will show you a very instructive chess game. This is the game between Jan and Kauschmann that was played in Berlin in 1988. White started with d4. Black played knight to f6. Bishop to g5. Trompovsky attack. Knight to e4. Attacking bishop. Bishop to f4 is the most popular move in this position. White played h4, and if knight takes bishop, then pawn takes knight, and rook on h1 is on semi-open file. In the game, black played d5, supporting knight. Knight to d2, challenging knight on e4. Queen to d6, and it looks like that queen is coming to b4, to fork pawn on d4 and one on b2. It is your move. How would you defend if you had white pieces? Would you play, I'll give you a tip, would you play c3 or perhaps e3? Have you decided? e3 is the correct answer. In the game, white played c3, and that is a blunder. And we have reached critical position of the game. It is black to move. If you wish, you can pause this video, and you can try to find the winning move that black played in this position. Ready? Did you find the winning move? Would you play this knight to g3 and white resigned in shock, believe it or not? In view of this continuation, pawn takes knight, queen takes pawn, check, mate. When people are in shock, they don't have good oxygen supply to their brain. And this was the case. Rook to h3 was playable. If rook to h3, knight takes bishop, for example, and after knight or king takes, bishop takes rook. So this is one variation. But there is even a better move for white in this position. Again, have a good look. What would you play in this position if you had white pieces? Rook to h2 is the best defense. For example, if a knight takes a bishop, then knight takes knight, and now knight is defending rook on h2 from queen. The game could have continued. f6, bishop to e3, knight to c6, Queen to c2, e5. This is just a simple continuation. Pawn takes pawn, pawn takes pawn, castling queenside, and white is still in the game. But unfortunately, in this position, white reacted too quickly and resigned. That is interesting, isn't it? And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video and that you learned something. I wish you good luck with your chess and bye for now.